going on? It's out of death dealer gray. If you've been checking out my previous videos, you will know that not only am I a fan of comic books, but I am a fan of battle rap. Heavily involved in the culture. And first and foremost, let's talk about this URL traffic card and redemption card. Now, I am not a believer of if it's not on smack, it don't count. I don't know where that bullshit ass excuse came from. And anybody who indulges in that excuse deserves to get three fucking old. Period. If you catch a point thirty at Mama's dear uncles and aunts rap league on the corner of fifty fourth and Weston or wherever the fuck, you lost. Doesn't matter if it's not on smack. So let me get on the redemption card. I think um, the redemption card has Chilla Jones and Prep, uh, Dot and Bill Collector. Yeah, okay, okay, right card, right card. So first off, how I feel about that card is I like the matchups. Uh, Bridge Rawlstein. And Tay Rock is a bit mismatched to me. I I do not understand that matchup, but you know it is what it is. And personally, I think Tay Rock gonna smoke him. I think Briz Briz is very unorthodox though, and he does have a chance to upset if he brings like that Grade A versus Dot Briz. Because I feel as though he does something unique. He doesn't do the t same boss setup, so I think that's cool. And North Kakalaki, you know what I mean? I got my brother live out there, so it's a bit of a bias. But then I'm from Baltimore, so I can't, I can't be too biased, you know what I mean? But definitely, I think that'd be a ill battle. So you know, that'd probably be a good one. Uh, Bill Collector versus Dot. I'm not impressed. I don't give a fuck about that battle. I think Dot is horrible. I think he's terrible. I think you know his setup is crazy. You know. When he battled Adi Boom, Adi Boom said reaches that were better than his. I grab the steel and pull it. Got the fridge. You know, that's the type of shit that he comes up with. You know what I'm saying? They got a long nose. You'll think it's an antelope. The fuck is an antelope? What, nigga? <laughs> but, alright, whatever. So, I think Bill Collect is very entertaining. And he low-key be having a couple bars here there. So, it's not like he can't put bars together. But... That'll be an entertaining battle, no less. You know, Badada give you that laugh factor. Because he, when has he won? You know what I mean? So, he needs redemption. Um, T-Top is a shotgun show. I think that'll be a good match. I think T-Top just needs to be more direct. Because he has a lot of time of telling these fantastic-ass Steven Spielberg stories. But, they be all over the place. You know what I mean? It's not about your opponent. And, plus, you know, Kakalaki boy. You gotta fuck with the guard. So, you know what I mean? Um, shotgun show, you know. I think Shotgun Sugar could do what he do, but, you know, sometimes that bullying, that doesn't win matches, you feel me? That makes you look good on stage, but that doesn't win rounds, you feel me? You you had a debatable battle with Saga, which I, I feel you won, but at the same time, Saga brought A-game shit. And that third round, if that was his whole, you know, preset all three rounds, he just smoked your boots, you feel me? So, that's that. Chilla Jones versus Prep. I feel Chilla Jones has one of the best pens in battle rap. And he's been very consistent with who he's battled. Nigga just battled Map Hoffa. Disaster. Daylight. You know what I mean? It, him and himself with Rider's Block. You know, they battle each other. You know, he doesn't do the overtly long setups to his punches. And really, he doesn't take a lot of clear losses. Like, even when he battled DNA. DNA destroyed him in the room. But when you watch it, ball for ball, it was a pretty decent, you know, battle. But, you know, he, he clearly lost. Don't get that confused. But... Chilla Jones definitely improved. He's definitely turned into one of the fiercest battlers that's out. Him in Danger Zone. And, you know what I mean? So, um, I also feel like Prep, he has a great pain game. But, you know, you beat Dot, arguably. You feel me? You lost to Chess. You know what I mean? You lost to the Saga. You lost to John John. Where do you get this big head from? I mean, I like his pen game, and he's a DMV nigga, so I, I want you to do great, but I don't see you out barring Chilla Jones, you feel me? And you niggas be like, battle random white boys. I mean, you know, the random white boys, you know, bring a different level of difficulty to battle because they're not just doing gun balls. So you have to be more versatile to battle in different places, which might give him an edge on the URL stage, since it's not like he's changed his content that much. He battled Real Deal, a nigga who does personals. And he did personals with Real Deal and had a great fucking battle with the guard. So, it is what it is. Um, Okay, so I think that's most of the battles on the Redemption card, is it? No? Who gives a fuck? On to the Traffic card. I feel the Traffic card 
it's going to be a lot better. You feel me? Um, Daylight versus Big T. I don't know why the fuck people are having this as being debatable. I feel Big T on A game will make it a, a very good battle. But Daylight has been consistently coming with great battles this year. You know, he's bars just coming. You feel me? He performs well. He knows how to control the crowd pretty decent. Not the best in the world, but enough to where niggas are still listening to his lyrics. So I feel as though Daylight, you know, all the faggot shit aside, I think Sun is pretty... Sun has one of the nicest pens out. You feel me? Riders Block got some sick pens. So Big T's not going to outbar him. That's out the question. Big T's going to have to outperform him, have better projection. And Big T hasn't really shown that yet. You know, I don't go by the what have you done for me now, but I go by what have you been doing lately. You know, your your latest battles haven't been that, you know what I mean, spectacular for me to think that Big T would just beat him. But I feel Big T on A game, like that old Big T versus DNA and Sue Surf, I feel as though he definitely can arguably take that win, but he, he got to come with it, you know what I mean? Um, Danger Zone versus Danny Myers, I think that's going to be a ball fest. Danger Zone to me is unstoppable. Shouts to the DMV, you feel me? Shouts to the DMV boys. Again, I feel like his penmanship is, is, is crazy. You know, his his performances got way better. You know, he knows how to just spit. And I guess that good battle made that nigga say, yo, I got to turn up on niggas. He been turning up. So, you know, Danny Myers is going to bring a usual grade A performance. You know, it's almost to a point where how can you see? How can you think he's not? I didn't talk about him on the redemption card because he's going to beat the shit out of Rex. I'm sorry. I don't, I don't see the debate going on. They might hype Rex over there, but he's going to die. Anyway, so I feel that's going to be a great battle. Tink the Demon and Diesel. I fuck with Tink the Demon. I like Tink the Demon. Charlotte, Kakalaki, you feel me? Uh, well, North Carolina, wherever the fuck they're from. But I definitely feel Tink the Demon is going to take that. Diesel's pretty straight, but eh, nothing really to talk about. Um, who else? KG the Poet versus B-Magic? He's going to die. Yeah, he's gonna die. Yeah, uh, KG's good, but he ain't not would be magic. You can't outbar him. That's not the question. You know, once again, the, the punch game is out. It's crazy, so you're not gonna outbar that nigga. So that's that. That's gonna be a loss. Yeah, it's gonna be a loss. But it might be a good battle though. But KG, if he steps it up, I think he can deliver because KG does have a good pen game. But let's see, man. Let's see. I like I like the ball heavy shit going on right now. Um. Who the fuck else? Steams and Young Cannon. Uh, I think Steams. Steams has a real nice pen game. I fuck with Steams. I think Steams is nice. You know what I mean? I think so. It's definitely ill for real. But Young Cannon is a monster. He's a monster. I'm sorry, motherfucker's a beast. So if you beat Young Cannon, I'll be surprised. You feel me? Young Kane is a monster, and he's been a monster. He's always been a monster. He's been getting better. You got to show me with that one, but Steams is nice. You know what I mean? Steams got a sick pain game. I fuck with that nigga's setup. It's unusual, but it's unorthodox, but it works really well. You know, I want to see that. I think the battle will be great, but I got Young Cannon on that one. I don't do the round shit 2-1 because I don't fucking... Who knows which rounds they'll take, but... Steams versus Rum Nitty. I think Rum Nitty is just a better opponent. Not Steams and Rum Nitty, my bad. Chess and Rum Nitty, excuse me. And Ch Chess is nice. You know, Chess has things to work out. He doesn't doesn't really have performance. He has presence, but Rum Nitty's going. If if it's if it's a huge stage, it might be more debatable. If it's a close room, Rum Nitty's going to destroy him. Rum Nitty's punches are out is outrageous. It, that writer's block shit, yo, you're not going to outbar these niggas in a small room. It's not going to happen. So, mm, I want to see that one. I think that'll be pretty good. I think that'll be, I think that'll be a pretty good battle, you know, but I I got Rum Nitty clearly taking that. So, if I missed any battles, please let me know. Let me know in, um, below in the comments, but I really feel as though, uh, you know, going to L.A., there's a lot of niggas the URL may not want to win. I'm going to win. That's how it is, man. And, you know, right now, Riders Block, man, they, pen game wise, 
Shit, even 40 Balls got a sick-ass pain game. You know what I mean? She got one of the nicest pain games. Battle rap. <laughs> you know what I mean? Next to a lot of these people, you know? So I want to see it. Uh, I'm kind of upset I'm not seeing more NWX versus Riders Blocks. Even though I don't think it really will be competition because I do think that pen game wise, Riders Block is a clear advantage. But at all round performance wise, I think NWX clearly have that advantage. So in a small room or big room, really determines the you know the level of tension in those battles. But overall, I think URL doing good things. You know what I mean? And hopefully they keep it up. But if you disagree with what I said about these two cards, please comment below. And I'll gladly debate you, but if you want to be ignorant and throw around racist-ass terms and all oh, your filthy nigger this and that and third, I'm not going to respond to that shit. I'm not even going to block you. I'm just not going to respond to that shit. You know, I'll probably beat the shit out you when I catch you in person. Anywho, like more videos, check my superhero shit out, because I like talking about comic books and shit too. And if not, have a good life. Whatever. <laughs> but... Check the description box below. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. I'll underscore the underscore deaf dealer. D-E-A-F-D-E-L-A. And check out the artwork that I also advertise on my Instagram and Twitter. And one love.